mounting the Multi-Filtrate Pro. To turn on the device, press the button for a few seconds. Then press Start to launch the operation test. While doing the test, select the CVVHD Sika treatment mode. Check what is needed before starting, and then press OK. Each step is indicated in the screen. Hang the saline bag to the right pole of the Multi-Filtrate Pro and install the filter on its support. Unfold the cassette and hang it onto the holder pins on the device. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the return system. Now you will install the return line, identified by the blue color, following the steps written in the screen. Install the bubble catcher in the level detector. Ensure the correct installation of the line in the optical detector and the bubble detector, then in the line occlusion clamp. Check the connection of the return line to the empty bag. Hang the empty bag to the right pole of the Multi-Filtrate Pro. Remove the paper attachment. Then screw the return pressure sensor. Connect the blue filter connector to the top of the filter. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the access system. Install the access line, identified by the red color following the steps written on the screen. Install the red positioner in the blood pump adapter until the sound signal is heard. Close the door. The line automatically inserts and the pressure measurement devices opens. Install the pressure sensor dome following the insertion indicated by the arrow direction. Continue the installation of the line by inserting it in the line occlusion clamp. Clamp the arterial line. To connect the access line to the priming bag use a three-way tap between the access line and the spike connector. Connect the spike to the priming bag. Install the pre-filter pressure dome following the arrow's direction. Finish by connecting the red filter connection to the filter. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the filtrate system. Install the filtrate line, identified by the yellow color. Place the yellow positioner in the filtrate pump until the sound signal is heard. Close the door. Install the filtrate pressure dome. Insert the filtrate line in the blood leak detector. Connect the yellow filter connection to the filter. Place the filtrate bag on the scales 3 and 4. Connect the filtrate line to the filtrate bag. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the dialysate bags. Place two dialysate bags without calcium on each upper scales 1 and 2. Assure yourself that they are in the right position. The bag connectors must be positioned backwards and downwards. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the dialysate system. Place positioner into the dialysate pump until the sound signal is heard. Connect the green filter connection to the top of the filter. Pull the heater bag with the green marking down into the heater. Connect the dialysate lines into the dialysate bag. Continue by pressing Next. Mounting the CCA system. Hang the citrate and calcium bags on the left of the Multi-Filter Pro. Close the two green clamps of the citrate line. Connect the citrate connector to the citrate bag. Insert the citrate drip chamber in the citrate drip counter. Place the positioner in the citrate pump adapter until the sound signal is heard. Close the two white clamps of the calcium line. Connect the calcium connector to the calcium bag using the adapter calcium secure Connect. Insert calcium drip chamber into calcium drip counter. Place positioner in calcium pump the sound signal is heard. 
Check that all steps have been followed and confirmed by pressing the button start. The citrate and calcium pumps will turn automatically to insert the closed lines automatically. Then close all the unnecessary clamps. Press OK to confirm that the circuit is fully installed. This type of message will appear with a sound alarm. For each alarm or warning, touch the button with an interrogation for help. The system will tell you how to solve the problem. The installation of the heparin pump is not necessary during a therapy with citrate anticoagulation. Press no to skip this step. Filling in the lines. To fill in the lines, break the cone of the citrate bag and open the clamp. The level is automatically between the two markers of the drip counter detector. Break the cone of the calcium bag and open the white clamp. Continue by pressing the start button. The filling of the citrate and calcium lines begins. Visually check the citrate and calcium lines are free of air. If necessary, press on the citrate or calcium button to complete the filling of the lines. Otherwise, press OK. Before starting the filling of the lines, open the red clamp of the access line. Open the three-way tap. Break the cones of the dialysate bags and check the tightness of all the lines. Continue by clicking start to start filling the tubing system. The treatment parameters will appear in the screen. Check the preset treatment and adjust if necessary. The circuit is filled in. When the message UF rinse appears in the screen. Turn the filter. Connect the return line to the sodium chloride bag and unclamp it. Open the three-way tap. Press the start button to start the UF rinse. A couple of tests are being processed to check that the circuit is properly installed. The Multi-Filtrate Pro adjusts the level in the bubble catcher. At the end of the priming, the Multi-Filtrate Pro automatically puts itself in recirculation mode while waiting for the patient connection. Only the blood pump turns. The Multi-Filtrate Pro is ready for the patient connection.